I'm your host, Miriam. Welcome to Short and Sweet, where we cook my favorite recipes breakfast, lunch, dinner, appetizers, cocktails, anything goes. Today, we're going to be doing the national dish of Nicaragua, gallo pinto, consisting of rice and beans. There is controversy about whether the dish originated in Nicaragua or Costa Rica, given that both countries have similar dishes by the same name, with the main difference being the types of bean used. Nicaraguans use small red beans and Costa Ricans use black beans. Gallo pinto literally means spotted rooster and it is said to have been given that name because mixing the rice and beans created a speckled appearance. This rice and beans dish has many variations throughout the Americas, the Caribbean and even Spain. In Panama and El Salvador, it's known as casamiento. In Peru, taco taco. In Spain, moros y cristianos. And in Cuba, con gris. In Nicaragua, gallo pinto is a dish that is served for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. And the ingredients are one medium onion, about four cloves of garlic, rice, two cups, three tablespoons of butter, and two cups of beans. Now the beans, I usually soak them beforehand, the night before, and then um, cook them the next day for about an hour and a half on medium heat. So just to cut on time, I've gone ahead and prepared a pot here, and this is ready, so we can go ahead and start doing our dish. We're gonna dice our onion, chunky. That's the first part. And now we mince the garlic. So, let's get this. Okay. Now let's go and saute the onions and the garlic. I've preheated this pan, so what we're gonna do is drop the butter in here. And let it melt a little bit and drop our garlic and our onions. So we're going to just saute this. I like to use butter. Some people like to use um, oil, but I like that buttery taste in my gallo pinto, so that's what I use. Okay. Okay, now that this is done sauteing, we're gonna add the beans. We're adding two cupfuls, and you're gonna drain the water out. You don't want any of the water. So you're just going to put the beans in there. And the whole purpose is basically to saute the beans as well, but not mash them. You don't want your beans to be mashed. You want to keep them whole. The key to this is getting it dry. Don't put any of the juice because you're gonna add that later on in, in the recipe. Okay, that's about two cups. So, let's get these beans going. Now basically, this will dry up. You need for it to wait to, to dry up. And once it dries up, we're going to mix it together with the rice. We're just gonna give it some time here. Okay, so the beans are ready. You can see that they're dry already. We've sauteed them, and what we're going to do is now add our rice. So, this is rice that has been done. I did it the day before because I like for it to be in the fridge. I like for it to be cold. That way it won't be mushy and you see that it easily separates and you don't want mushy rice in this because it's not going to mix properly. So, let's give this a mix. And you're going to see that the rice is going to get some color. And now, we're going to cover this and let it steam for a few minutes just so that the rice it can get warm and soft. We're going to put it in low now, just to steam for about five minutes. Mm, okay, this is ready. What we're going to do now is add a little bit of this juice, about one fourth cup, just to give it more color, to make it more moist. We don't want it to be dry. Okay. Just 
just mix this up a little bit. Maybe for about one more minute. Look at this. Very simple dish to make. This is Nicaraguan's national dish and we eat it with eggs, with steak, basically with anything. So if you want to check out more videos, go to sas.210tv.com, follow me on Twitter at Miriam2799, and go to our forums and talk about our dishes. Until next time, 